Hi guys! Today I'm going to introduce the groundbreaking Wi-Fi bird box camera that revolutionizes your bird watching experience. Now you can effortlessly stream live footage in high resolution directly to your television with compatibility for Amazon Alexa and Google Home devices. This camera let you take full advantage of voice command to simplify your streaming process. The Wi-Fi Bird Box camera is IP66 waterproof rated, therefore it's great for outdoor application. It can produce 3MP Ultra HD color images by day and deliver crisp black and white images by night using the invisible infrared LEDs. Also, with the 2.5mm lens, this HD Barbara camera can display a large field of view of up to 120 degrees, which is ideal to use for enclosure space like a birdhouse. It can also support live stream on your smartphone, tablet, or PC devices. Push message notifications are available at every trigger event when the Wi-Fi bird box camera detects any movement inside the bird box. Also, you can install memory card to watch the recorded footage on your phone so you won't miss a moment. You will need to run a power cord or power it with a rechargeable battery using the DC 12V battery cable if there's no power outlet nearby. So without saying, Let's see how to do the whole connection together. So now I'm going to connect the Wi-Fi bird box camera so you can watch live video footage on your Fire TV. Let's power it up first using the power outlet. You can see the indicated light is on. Next, let's move to our phone. Open up our Smart Life application and add device. We're adding a camera, so let's scroll under camera and using Wi-Fi, let's press this one. Now we need to reset our camera. We can simply reset the camera by pressing this button. Let's hold it down until we see the lights on. Okay, and then let's hit next and enter the password number, your Wi-Fi network, the name. Make sure you put all your devices under the same Wi-Fi network so they can link with each other. Now we can see the barcode and use your camera facing the barcode around 15 to 20 centimeter will be enough. And let's give it a little bit of time to connect to the camera. I found a security camera. And Alexa already found it because this phone is already connected to the Echo Dot. We can also change our camera name since you might have more than one camera. Let's say... Camera 1. And done. You can see we have a live video now. You can take screenshot, you can talk, you can record video footage on your phone and also you can play back. Let's go outside under me. We have the third party services. Choose the one that's suitable for you. I'm using Alexa for today. And it's already linked. It will ask you to give authorize to Alexa and connect the Smart Life application with the Alexa. So now it's been connected, let's try it out. Alexa, please show me camera one. Okay, sending to TV. 
This might take a few seconds. Sure. As you can see, the live video is already on our television. So now you can just watch your bird box at home using Alexa Echo Dot or just using the remote control and talk to Alexa. So now I'm going to talk a little bit more about the Wi-Fi bird box camera. So when the image is very blurry, actually you can adjust the lens by yourself. Let's remove the cap first and then moving it around to catch the perfect image. Here we go. After you're done, just simply close the cap. Next, I'm going to show you our special brackets inside the birdhouse. You can see when we mount our camera, this is usually how it will look, like this. However, we cannot see the entrance of the birdhouse. Just simply twist the angle to 90 degrees, and now you can see the entrance of the birdhouse. That means you can see the birds flying in and out by simply just moving the bracket, the bracket to 90 degrees. So that is all for today. Not only you can use your mobile devices to play back the video footage, you can now use Alexa or just a remote control to watch the bird box camera on your big television live.